Hello everybody, another beautiful day to be working on the roof. Uh, it's about 72 degrees, so I, I just finished soldering these two lines, the vapor and the liquid line, and I'm gonna perform a pressure test with nitrogen gas. Uh, so this unit is uh, 18,000 BTUs, ton and a half, and the refrigerant is 22. I have here my nitrogen tank, and I have my gauges, and I have, of course, my condenser. These valves still have the cores inside. Uh, you could do it with the cores in, but we're gonna we're going to remove them because when you're removing, everything is faster, and time is money. This condenser comes pre-charged with 5.4 pounds of refrigerant, and from here back, it's sealed. It, it, uh, we're gonna remove the core so it doesn't matter because it's uh, front seated and uh, we're gonna remove the cores and uh, the refrigerant is not going to escape because it's, it's trapped inside the unit so we're gonna remove this core and now we're gonna remove the other one so you're gonna insert uh, this part of the tool and just turn counterclockwise about five turns and then the core is gonna come out. Then once you're done, you just pull it out and you see there, uh, we're gonna put them here. This part of the tool is magnetic, so you just keep it there so uh, you'll see it that is there. Now we're gonna make sure our gauges are closed before we start. Okay, so this is uh, the blue side and the blue hose is gonna go on the vapor line, the bigger line. And just make sure it's tight. And now the red manometer, the red hose is gonna go into the smaller line, that's the li liquid line. Now we're gonna connect this yellow line and uh, is the only port on this regulator. So we're gonna put it there. Just make sure it's tight. And now we're just about to start. So before we do anything, we're gonna move this handle to the left counterclockwise to get it ready until you hear a pop. And that's the spring telling us that it's ready. Now we're gonna open up this handle and it's gonna show you, show you in this gauge on the right, the pressure on the tank. And we have about 27,000, I mean 2,700 pounds of pressure. And now um, this gauge on the left is, uh, we're gonna move this handle to the right and then the needle on the left is gonna move uh, on the desired pressure we want. So if you want more, we want 150, we're gonna turn more to the right until the needle gets to 150. Now we're gonna open up both of the gauges, the low and the high side. The low is on the left and the high is on the right. We're gonna open both. And in this particular uh, condenser, the design test pressure is 150 on the low side. So you don't wanna go uh, too much past 150. So I got it 161 and that's enough. And I put a mark, uh, a black mark right there because we are gonna uh, close everything and let it sit like for 10, 15 minutes to make sure it's not leaking. Okay, so after 15 minutes, the needle didn't move at all. So we are good. And uh, now we're gonna test the pipes, the solders, uh, to make sure it's not leaking there. And uh, just to make, double make sure. So these are the two that we soldered, or that we braced. And now we're gonna test. And I like this product because it's thick, so uh, stays there. 
and as you can see we don't have any leaks uh, there's no bubbling so that means that uh, the Union is good Okay. So now we are going to release the nitrogen. Uh, nitrogen is not harmful to the ozone layer, so it's okay to vent it to the atmosphere. So this is my nitrogen tank. I already shut it off here. And then I'm going to retract these. release it from here from this with the gauge is still open we're gonna remove it from here I know uh, okay we're gonna close so this is closed and this is now we can remove our gauges and put them away and we're going to set up uh, to perform a vacuum because we're going to uh, charge it. We're going to uh, open up the valve so the gas goes back to the whole system. So thank you so much for watching. If it was useful to you, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video.